This is Bliss Hill in Birmingham. It's a fantastic place. It's a three pound park. And then you have an overflow car park. Three pound. Not bad. That's it. Here we go. Oh, you go out that way, don't you? Ace in it here. Love it. Yeah. And one good thing here, doggies are allowed. Yeah, if you want. Where do you want to go? You're not going in there, Ma. Go on then. In these shops, you can actually buy um, material. You've got a chemist where you can buy soaps, perfumes, and you can pay new money or old money. And you can get your money from the bank. And in there you can actually have your pitch taken, old style. That is a cute little sweet shop. And that there, we'll be going there soon, is a fish and chip shop. And they cook the fish and chips really, really nice. It's a beautiful 
place. And then down there you've got the um, chemist and it was actually featured on Edwardian farm, Victorian farm, one of them. usually open is it? Yeah. No. It's a garden. garden. There is a similar museum called Black Country where they film Peaky Blinders and other TV shows. But we've come here because we have the dog today. Right. And there, they have the old price up and the new price. Any building you can pretty much go in and there's always people to tell you a bit about the place they're in. Oh, 
you know the man in the previous shop was saying if you see a tap you're more than welcome to use it to get your dog some water which is good four candles <laughs> Where this used to be is actually a fish and chip shop called Andy's Fish Bar. You know, it says it all really, don't you? Fish and chip shop and the fish and chip shop. Really. <laughs> It was, that was used for making oboes and clarinets and well, bagpipes. Um, it has a high oil content, so it was, uh, if you're blowing down an instrument, you're introducing moisture. But for one thing, it's so dense, it won't move about. And you've got your oil to protect the water as well. The one on the end, the giant sequoia, of course, is so quick growing. Um, but it's water resistant. And we use <laughs> That's cool. so much to do here like I say every shop you can go and you can pay new money old money um, when you're walking on the left there's a bank and you can get new money changed into old money so it's a good way of teaching people the way of old money and all the staff are very very friendly and very helpful if you ever Want any information? And I think the biggest bonus here is you can bring your dog. Um, and like the man said in the previous shop, you can go in anywhere apart from the sweet shop, fish shop. So we're on our way to the fish shop now because it's amazing. Yeah, 
Yes, you can have an old style photograph done. My mum had one taken about four years ago. It's good fun. If you want a dead fox wrapped round your neck. Okay. And the tip is when you get here, go to the fish and chip shop because it does get busy. But the food from the fish and chip shop is cooked in beef dripping. So if you're vegetarian, the chips will be cooked in beef dripping. And they have an old fashioned fairground here. It should, well, I think they're just starting to get it open again for the summer coming. But usually that's full of kids. So they've got school, cafe, and there's the fairground. It was pretty cool at night when it's all lit up and everyone's in the costumes. No. Uh 
halfway to the spur of a grappling and everything. Where are you? Three cute little piggies. There's one thing for sure though, Baz. You won't be able to live there. <laughs> <laughs> That'd be a foot bath for him. She got some used to people as well. Yeah, got a lot of people she sees. Well, my friend's doing a lunch course in a lunch course, take a dog in. Yeah. So I said, I'll take a photo of her down the bottom. Up down the bottom. And the girl said, We've got no lunch course, so I'll have it then. Right, again. Look at that little bed. Tiny. Well, Cookie, that's not bed. <laughs> Come on. Come on. <laughs> Is it a board across? Um, she's border with. Uh, I was going to say the face is from border, isn't it? Yeah, she's a little border with. Patterdale. Oh, yeah. right. Yeah, see the, the long face. Yeah. yeah. Uh oh. Got a new for you. Ooh. Got to change your name to Squeaker. It's got the border <laughs> build and then the face is completely different. Yeah. She's lovely. She's she knows something. Wasn't this a toll house? Okay, we've just found out something amazing. That green hut all the way down there. That actually belonged to Fred Dibner. Um, so I'm very, very excited about that because I love Fred Dibner. So they must be having a steam weekend. You can actually go for a ride on these horses and they'll take you around. So 
that's our trip done to um, Blister Hill. So if you liked it, give us a thumbs up. <laughs>do get about is a five or six attractions on that no, that's one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, 10, 47 eight, people 10 attractions 25 quid as many times as you want yeah.